Hello guys, I'm back with another video and uh, this time I want to recap my last competition. Um, yeah, it was already two weeks ago, but now I finally get the time to speak about it and tell you how it went and what are my thoughts about it. So we're just going to start chronologically with uh, yeah, my attempts, my warm-ups of squat, bench, deadlift and yeah, let's go. My last warm-up in squat was 240 kilos. And um, it went well, it was, it was fast, um, but I already got the comment from some people in the warm room that it wasn't quite deep enough. And uh, yeah, then I went on for my first squat with 255 kilos uh, to not go too heavy and maybe you know protect my knee a bit. And um, yeah, the 255 day went really well, but they got red lighted because they weren't deep enough. My actual planned second attempt was 272, so I lowered it a bit to um, 265 um, because yeah, I wanted to be still 100% sure that I can get that, but I didn't want to repeat 255, so I did 265 in the second attempt and yeah, it went well, it was deep enough, so then I had to think, okay, what what do I go for in the last one? And uh, my goal before was like 280, but I didn't want, qu didn't quite want to make such a big jump, so I went to 277, and yeah, it was, it also went quite well. Um, many people said that was easy for a last attempt; you could have done more, and yeah, I think I could have done a bit more, but I'm also not too sad about it because uh, usually I like to go that strategy that uh, I don't go too heavy in my squats to save some energy for bench and deadlift later on. Then um, after squats there was a warm-up for bench and that wasn't actually <laughs> very great. I got quite dizzy uh, in the warm-up room and um, yeah, I was a bit anxious because my opener was quite high with 180 but yeah I didn't didn't lower it so um, I thought, okay, whatever. I just do 180. Should be should be able to do it still. And yeah, so I went, did my first attempt with 180, and it was okay. It went well. It wasn't like too surprisingly heavy or something like that. Um, happy that I got it. And yeah, what I have to note is that it was a bit unusual to wait so long for the commands. Um, sure, that's always something in in comp that there's a danger, but yeah, that definitely took some energy, especially um, like holding the weight and then waiting for them to just start um, the command already uh, to to go down, and then obviously you have to wait again until they say press. Yeah, but um, yeah, that went well, so I went to one eighty five in the second attempt, and that was pretty hard. Um, yeah, so my initial plan was 180, 185, and then 190. But after the 185, I was pretty sure <clears throat> 190 is going to be very difficult. Um, so I'd rather take two and a half kilos if I can with 187. And yeah, I <laughs> failed 187 with strength, so not even that was there. Which is a bit sad that for some reason my bench was super weak uh, at that day. But if you look at my attempt selection, it was kind of perfect because the minimal jump that you can do is two and a half kilos. So I did 185, I got that. I tried two and a half kilos more, I failed that. That means 185 was the maximum that I could have done on that day and I did it. So nothing wasted on the bench. Then with the warm-ups for deadlift, it was also a bit weird in the moment. I didn't feel strong at all, um, everything was feeling heavy and I also got a bit dizzy. Uh, with the last warm-up that I did, it was 250 kilos and uh, yeah, I kind of blacked out for a little bit. Um, I could sit down in time, but yeah, I was uh, really um, yeah, lightheaded. And yeah, I was also then <laughs> again a bit anxious if I could actually do my opener. Um, but looking back, the, two the 250 were actually quite fast. And then also my opener with 280 were also 
quite fast. And um, so then with for my second attempt, I kind of need to check the scoreboard and um, I um, checked and my plan was to do kind of what I needed to do to stay ahead of my um, opponent. And because he was better in bench and squat, um, I needed to have 12 and a half kilos higher deadlift than him, which uh, was very similar to what I actually had planned. So initially I had planned 305 kilos in the second attempt, and that actually turned out to be exactly 12 and a half kilos more than what my opponent put in as his second attempt. So then, yeah, I decided to do 305. Interestingly, my opponent failed his second attempt. So then when it was for me to deadlift 305, I knew I don't actually have to pull this anymore because, um, yeah, or I could pull less, but you can't change the second attempt. So I was also a bit anxious. Ooh, hopefully, you know, I get this 305, but I got it. 305 went up. And so now I got the second place quite secure. Um, and then there was a chance for me to actually get to first place, even though that would have been quite difficult. And I checked and if I can pull 315 and the other opponent, which is currently on number one, fails his last deadlift, then I will win. So I put in uh, 315. And um, my opponent, he isn't a strong deadlifter, so he got, um, he was before me, so he got his last deadlift done, me which means that I uh, would have needed even more than 315 to win, so I would have had the chance to up my last attempt to 322, which I, if I would have done that, I would have won, but I thought, okay, no, 322, that's not there today. So I just decided to stick with uh, 315. I could have also lowered it, um, but I thought, whatever, I just try the 10 kilo jump. And um, yeah, unfortunately, 315 was a bit too heavy on that day. Um, yeah, but it is what it is, right? So in the end, I got a 776.5 kilo total. And um, that's my first competition in the 105 kilo class. Um, before I was always starting 120, um, so yeah, I'm, I'm fairly happy. It could have been better, but it was a, definitely a PR when it comes to relative points. So regarding my body weight, that is lower. Um, I'm quite happy with my performance, and um, yeah, I learned a bit um, again about competing. It was generally just nice to compete again after two years. So we'll see. It seems like nationals. Uh, the next national next year will be quite early. Um, they are set for February, so it's just half a year, and then there's already the next nationals. And um, if if it happens, because there's nothing set in stone yet, but that's the general plan. And yeah, we'll see if I can get my 800 kilos in February, which will be really nice. Um, yeah, goal or stepping stone to just put a check behind that. But yeah, that was my. My German Nationals, second place at the end, quite happy, PR and relative points, so good start in the new 105 kilogram class.